Hello, everyone. How are you doing today? Today will we be will be trying something new. Hello, sir. Thank you for arriving. What excellent timing. Hello. Zangief. Would you like? Oh no! Come here. We will be trying something new. No. Sick. Speak. 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 Come on. Thank you. Speak. Speak. There you go. That's one. Go get it. All right. Now. We'll be trying this. Yeah. Come here. Come here. Sit. Speak. 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 Come on. Speak. Speak. Yeah, it's probably better. Anyway, so we're going to be trying the RTX stuff. Hopefully that helps a little bit. It might result in me being slightly distorted at times. But I figure, considering this seems to be the time that he wants to go crazy, that uh, it might be a, an improvement. <laughs> Motherfucker. This dog's gonna kill me with this shit. So, he is actually growling quite loud and squeaking his toy right now. How's that work? Better than nothing? Listen, the dog has decided that 7 o'clock is his playtime. So I can either move the stream, lock him upstairs in the bathroom where he will die alone, or we can try this new technical solution. See, I don't know if you know something about bulldogs. Uh, if you leave them alone for 10 minutes, they will just die. If you, if you don't look at them or pet them or have them on the slobber on you... They just, they just fade away like back to the future. I should mic up Geef. You people are crazy. I, I have never gotten, has, so Ranryu asks, was anyone asking for less dog noises? Yeah, me. I felt bad last night. I saw a couple people that had to, uh, to leave the Lost in Vivo stream because Geef was going fucking nuts for the whole time. And I, I genuinely felt bad. So to answer your question, yeah, me. Ugh. Put a GoPro on Geef and stream his point of view. You're going to see a lot of masturbating dog dick. I don't know if that's what you want. Like a lot. Like a lot of masturbating dog dick. Ivan Mistwalker says, I thought he was fixed. Yeah, 
Just because your dog ain't got no balls doesn't mean they won't masturbate. We had a girl dog back when I was a kid who was fixed, and she'd hump everything in sight. Oh, I gotta... Oh, I'm too hot. Oh, I gotta take this off. Ugh. People with a vasectomy still have sex, bro? Okay, I want to make a really clear distinction to uh, about vasectomies. You don't lose your balls when you get a vasectomy. They just snip your vas deferens. Why are you talking about that? Oh, because I'm talking about the dog masturbating. Because people said... I'm, I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm toning down dog with technology, right? And then someone says, put a GoPro on the dog. And I say, if I put a GoPro on the dog, you're going to see a lot of dog masturbation. Yeah. And then somebody says, well, isn't he fixed? And I go, yeah, so? And then somebody said, well, people with vasectomies still have sex. And it's like a dog getting fixed is not the same as somebody having a vasectomy. I am fascinated to hear what the stream sounds like right now. Because he's been going nuts. He's been a perfect gentleman in helping me with my test. Very helpful. It... No, Paige. I'm not going to butt chug that. It's way too big for any person to butt chug. Anyone who butt chugs that will die. Paige got some of the cooler. Whatever, man. Yeah. This page is gonna be real spirited. Paige, if you have a single shot of anything, you're very spirited. Butt chugging is really stupid. I don't understand the, pu the purpose of butt chugging. No, but butt chucking is not just dangerous. It's also like, just just drink it through your mouth, dude. But I am not the kind of person who would butt chug. I'm the kind of person who doesn't want anything in my butt. Hopefully not. I'm trying to improve the stream. <laughs> No, my water! No! No, that's my water. Don't spit on me, please. Yeah, guys, could you hear Paige at all? Nope. Oh, sick. Yes? Eh. Eh. Lick it. Lick his water. Bless it. Look how pretty he is. His head is so big. Really? They can't hear me. Wow. Wow. So Zangief uh, went to the, 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 the doggy spa today. Um, wait, my own laughter goes silent sometimes. Does that imply that the robot doesn't think that me laughing is a human noise? No, it thinks you're a woman. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, darn. But, um, I sound like Geef's squeak toy. That's not true. Um, that's not true at all. <laughs> no, see, it's there. <laughs> no, see, that's my normal laugh. That's my normal laugh. All right. Ugh. Eh. Eh. Mm. Oh, wow, I hear that. What? Yeah, you do whatever you do whatever you do, you do, you do, you do. It's fun to mock your person. You're my person. You mock me. You called me pussy no balls on stream the other day. Yeah. Oh damn. All right, so Dying Light 2 just came out, like literally just now, just came out. Wait, there's an update! Wow. Shut up! 
I was able to fucking install it and run it once and then kick it back to Steam and now there's an update. That's fucking hilarious. Why was that not just rolled into the fucking game? That's fucking funny. Oh man, video games are fucking terrible. I don't know if you guys have ever seen a video game. They're stupid. They're fucking dumb. Luckily, I have my new NVIDIA Drive Wars. They will help me get my DLSS on the DLS OC. <sighs> All right, let's let's thank let's thank some some people. Let's thank some people. Man, before we do that, did you guys ever download a digital game off the PlayStation Store on the PS3? You would download the full game, and then you would have to download every patch sequentially off of it. And it was unbelievable. It was the worst. It was unbelievable. Oh my god. It was so bad. It was so bad. Oh my god. That console sucked ass. Nailed it. What the fuck is this game that's called Application Title? Oh my god, I need to pull this up for you people. This is so fucking funny. This is hilarious. So, probably not. So, uh, I did the GeForce Experience scan for the Dying Light 2. And the game's called Application Title, and it has no settings listed. Not even a single setting. So you guys can't hear the dog at all, huh? Like at all? Barely? Yeah, he's, he's, he's borking up a storm over there. That's great. All right, good. Only when I'm talking, huh? Okay, well, we're going that we're dude, I'm trying. I'm trying a new thing, okay? I'm working on it. All right. Oh. Work lazier? Oh, well, I think I'm pretty lazy. All right. What am I doing? I, for I fucking forgot. Oh, I'm thanking people. Right. Thank you. All the dishes are done, by the way. Paige. All the dishes are done except for that one uh, fucking uh, pot that's, that you made the the clafuti in. You can check it, but it's probably still covered in, in shit. You're welcome. Hey, anonymous sub. Thanks, anonymous. Appreciate it. Very kind of you. Tron kicked in 500 bits. Thanks, Tron. I honestly never thought I'd see this game release. Hope you have fun. It's not Star Citizen. Did you hear the Star Citizen news today, darling? Star Citizen has decided that their roadmap was too unclear, so they are going to have no roadmaps anymore. Oh, okay. But make sure to give more money. I saw the absolute ultimate version of that where a guy said that his friends in junior high school told him he was stupid for not kicking in money to the best game ever and he's graduating from grad school now and the game's still not out yet junior high to grad school some dude like fuck like when you're an adult like ah oh, 10 years right but then you got to put it in the proper context right the context is how many years of high school would you have gone through? The problem is you're not giving him your booze. He wants it. Okay, well then I, I'll thank the people and then I will take him out for bathroom. Alright. 
Nelson sub says, who's Steve Jobs? Lick my balls, buddy. I'm still mad at you. About the cheese. Remember that fancy cheese you told me about? You don't remember the other night in bed when you said that you'd there was this fancy cheese that you had found out called Fromunda? Oh yeah. Fromunda these balls! Oh. I was so mad. I was so mad. I was so mad. Because I don't think they can hear me. No, they heard you. Ramunda, I was like, oh my God, Pat, you have to try this incredible new cheese. And he was so excited to call it. It's called Framunda. It's like Framunda. And I said, Framunda, these I don't know about tulips. What about tulips, sign Shoto? Braves Robin kicked in five and a bit. Says zombie goes nom nom nom. Yes, that's true, Braves, and or Robin. That's true. Good job, Iron Oki sub. Thanks, Iron Oki. Thanks for all, that's what. Mm. That's for all the streams, Pat. That's for all the streams, Pat. Keep on screaming like a scream lord. Will do. Thank you. Thank you. Manos kicked in a sub. Thanks, Manos. So today at work, I got a caller. He started ranting about how he's a T. Are those not okay to say? I don't know. I also don't get the joke. I do get it. I, I I'm just going to pass. I'm just going to pass. I don't think they said anything wrong. Yeah. For the sake of... Us not knowing. Anyway, he's too tense. <laughs> Wait, to be fair, though... Now I get it. Now I get it. Yeah. The surprise? Yeah. I don't think that's bad. You think she's gonna read it? Gonna read what? The people are like, you read it, Paige. What? What do you guys... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, you think it's a slur? Get Paige to read it. What? Well, you do read those fanfics. I don't read those words, though. Yeah, but you did read the part where Shadow, where Sonic spray painted himself black and punched out Amy's teeth. Come on, anyone would I, read dude, that. Dude, so 999 screaming ghosts coming out of his penis, that's good. But spray painting him, his fur black and punching out Amy's teeth is the, oh my god. Dude, no. Oh, screaming man. Ghosts is a core memory now. Oh. It's never leaving. I'd punch out Amy's teeth. Fuck that bitch. She's creepy. creepy. Scary, scary boy supreme sub. Pat, I need your help. A friend of mine keeps trying to look cool, but. Ha recently has dropped a katana he was twirling and grabbed the blade to catch it and Hit his nuts with a crowbar while making a Half-Life joke. How do I save this man from himself? You can't. There's no fixing that. Um, the, the He'll stop once he really hurts himself. Like how the 21-foot the guy, the guy who said that you could always catch up with a gunman within 21 feet, how he was playing with swords in his backyard and he fell and stabbed himself in the face and like dramatically injured himself. Then he stopped making videos about the 21 foot rule in his backyard. Uh, there, there's, there's nothing, there's nothing to be done. <laughs> Racy Smooth says gain self-awareness or perish. Oh, 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 man. A uh, little to shot sub. Thank you. Bork stoppers tech has become so advanced. Algorithm on Michael Vick.
Odds Logic sub. Thanks, Odds Logic. Appreciate it. Mask of Michael kicked in five or the bits. So we have Orb, Papyrus, Garrus, Quark, and Mustard. What? Orb, Papyrus, Garrus, Quark, and Mustard. Are there any other characters we need to know about in the Peach Saliva Harem anime? Sans and Papyrus, but they're in the Mafia. I do. I do. And Skeletor? Yeah. I like the part where Skeletor um, goes through a mirror and then punches the mirror into pieces. There's too much flesh on the body, she says. I'm just reiterating what you're saying because I think you're muted. Oh, this power. Oh, this strong power. <laughs> well, oh man, pa so much of Paige gets cut out, you sound mad. This is awesome. This is the- Yeah, like I sound like I'm gaslighting myself. <laughs> uh, there's something really wild about how this technology mutes women. I bet- I bet- that's actually real because I bet most of the shit they fed into the robot for speech was men talking. That's what I bet. Working as intended. Hey. Time Puncher sub. Thanks, Time Puncher. Video Goblin kicked in a sub. Been rewatching the Pages Undertale stream so I can refresh the pain. How can this be? How can this be? Mongoot. Can you hear Paige cooking and pissing? Sorry, she's, she's pissing so hard it sounds like fried chicken. Can, can y'all hear that? Nope. I think the only thing that ever comes through is chopping vegetables. Yeah. Nothing can be done with that. And nope, 80808 kicked in a sub. When you gonna, what? <laughs> when are you and Shillup gonna boss box over whether Destiny 2 is trashed or not? Why, why are we calling skill up Shillup? Is that like a thing? Because Skillup's never done anything to me. He seems very nice. I have friends that know him, and they've told me he's very nice. So I'm, I seem loath to uh, use a pejorative nickname. He calls himself that? That's awesome! <laughs> Fuck! That's super good! Oh, I love that! Selling out rules! Shoot bang EXE. How about this? How about this? How about... We have a debate on how awesome... Uh, Destiny is. And Luke Smith gives us some of his 1 million retention bonus, and I just have it, and then I say, oh, Destiny's so good. Ooh, so good. Oh. Hey, Pat, why do you stream so much more than Paige? Because I'm the man of the house, and Paige is busy cooking and cleaning. <laughs> So that's a very that's a very good question. Why do why do why do I uh why do I stream less? Um well first of all, so uh streaming is Pat's job. Like that is Pat's job. I actually have a full-time job. I have a full-time job, and on top of that, I also um I also clean this house and I also cook for the house. 
So by the time, and I'm also, I'm also, I just have so little energy to do those things I need to do that by the time streaming comes around, I'm just like, I'm so fucking And I so love you very tired. much oh and I God. appreciate it, honey. Oh. That's why I have to be here in the mines with you fucking freaks. Wouldn't that be crazy? Day after day. Yeah. I mean, I've, like, I've considered, like, ooh, what if I streamed full time? Paige, if you got super popular, if you became, like, like five times as big as, as me, I would gladly become a stay-at-home husband. Would you? Uh, yeah. yeah. Easy. I like would not that. eat. Well, yeah, I would eat your cooking. Um, well, if it's all I have to do, I'd probably, be, I'd, I'd learn how to cook good. Yeah, no, no, Pat, Pat can cook. He just doesn't like to. Um, but yeah, I mean. I'm I, already stay-at-home? Yeah, well, okay. No, I'm work from home. Thank you. Thank you. I've considered um, going full-time. I, I really like, you know. Okay, that was all fun and games, but Hewlett fan has a much better question. What's that? Do your pets really smell as much as you joke that they do? Not at all. No, they don't smell no. bad at all. No, Elmo smells really good. Uh, Zangief smells really good, especially right now. He just got a yeah. shower. No, they very rarely smell. They smell when they are gassy, which is yeah, a little more fart. than we would like. But no, they smell great. But uh, no, we like to call them stinky because it's fun to call your animal stinky. That's it. Where's the dog at? Is he calm now? I guess he didn't need to pee. Should I take him out anyway? Hey guys, if you guys were me, would you take the dog out anyway now? Yeah, you would? Okay. I'll be back in 10 minutes. No, 5 minutes. 5 minutes with an emptier dog. So I'll see you guys in a second, and then we'll load up Dying Light 2, which will hopefully be not very buggy. I'm not holding out hope. Okay, bye for now.
God damn, that light is blue. Also, Paige, I'm back on the thing. Hey guys, what's up? Mm. Oh, Pocket Bear Illustrator kicked in five bucks. Thanks, Pocket Bear Illustrator. Good, wait, why are you donating to me? That's my money that I just gave you. Like, I'm not gonna fight you, right? But like, I don't get it. I I don't get it. Like I like I have a bunch of artists that follow me and like give give a donation or whatever, and then my like, oh here's a, you go here's a money for a emotes or here's a money for an intro, and then they show up and like sub, and I'm like, that's mine. Anyway. Pocket Bear Illustrator says, Hey Pat, I was wondering if you ever dealt with imposter syndrome, and how would you normally deal with it if you're ever in that slump? Hope you, Paige, and the boys are well. Absolutely. Working in content creation is a course on how to deal with imposter syndrome, particularly this kind of content creation, because this is a fake-ass job that even the Canadian government doesn't even fully recognize as, like, they don't know what to call it. Yeah. Um... I'm playing video games and doing a show and slapping my tum tums and yelling about farts and switching my dog and, and yelling at my girl and all this crap. Uh, it's fake it till you make it 100%. And then once you make it, you fake it some more. You just, you pretend like it's a funny little secret and it's like, hee 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 hee. And instead of this, like, oh man, I'm, you know, I'm not really as cool as or as good as yeah. whoever may say. You like ha 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 jokes on them, yeah. right? I'm actually a piece of shit, and I'm honest about it. Yeah, so it's a lot like having sex with a rich guy. You just keep faking it until the money happens. Um, uh, please stop hitting my microphone. Oh, do you have friends who don't know what you do? No, I do. Not anymore. Almost, almost no one knows what I do. Like, I lie about what I do all of the time. I lie to everyone. It's I true. don't like telling fucking anybody anything. Like, no one knows I stream. No one knows I do no, no, no. any of it. I have, I have a, like, a legitimate... I have a legitimately depressing anecdote for y'all. And names won't be named. There is an absolute certainty. There is an absolutely 100% way to beat imposter syndrome... For whatever field that you're in. Here it is. Are you ready? Do a night of work in which you're like, well, I might not be the best, but I did a pretty good job. And then see what you made from that night of work. And then see somebody that is way, way shittier than you. Do a way, way shittier job for more money and go, oh no, that's what an imposter looks like. Like, I know writers who will be like, oh, I'm a shitty writer and I'll write their, I'll read their stuff and it's like, this is pretty good. But also, uh, there are TV shows getting greenlit af off of people's shitty Twitter accounts. Like... Like, success is no measure of quality. I'm throwing shit at Wooly? No, Wooly does a good job. I'm absolutely not talking about Wooly. I'm talking about people who are way shittier. Come on, that was fun to say, though. <laughs> <laughs> hey and uh thug nasty sub thanks thug nasty appreciate it all right let's figure out how to play the video game hey dead cells and dying light have almost the same icons on steam that's weird no page unless you think you're way shittier than i am Nailed it. Oh, wow.
Civilization is a vulnerable thing, a whim of circumstance. Hello? There, I did it. I did it. I did it. I forgot to put the NVIDIA thing in the thing. Smart. Forgot to do the thing. All right, that should do it. You should be hearing video game no noises now. Right? Oh yeah, there's no game on the fucking screen. That's great. Is a vulnerable thing. Shut up. Show me the video game. Game capture, dying light 2, inactive. Wait, now, now it's there? Why is it there now? What the fuck? Oh, this game's gonna be so good, you guys! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be so good. I pressed any key. That's, that's fine. I pre-ordered it 22 minutes before it came out. That counts, right? Okay, I, I, I'm gonna go with whatever the fuck these guys want me to go with, I guess. Um... Zombos. It is. Hey, look, guys! The, the, the props... Oh, thank you, I would love that. The, the video game prompts that... Oh, there they I found them. They're back. Features for advanced users, huh? Yeah, well, no, they can hear him a little bit. Sometimes when he barks big time, what happens is he... Um, uh, it, it goes... Like, like the tiniest... You guys hate motion blur, right? Right? You guys hate motion blur? That's what you always want me to turn off? Yeah? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna keep all of these the same. Yes. Hopefully the game runs good. Let's find out. I'm gonna play single player because I'm cool. There's a streamer mode in the options, is there? Mute any licensed music. I love that, thank you. All right, new game. We're gonna do it on normal baby mode. Normal, a balanced experience for the majority of gamers. That's me, gamer. Enemies pose a reasonable, th oh, you know what, I gotta, ugh. Oh my god, there's so many moving parts going on here. So many big moving parts. Wah. Wah. I just want to be able to see if the game audio works. Okay, their game audio. I see it. Hee hee hee. Okay. I truly am a gamer, Greg. Thank you. Uh, anyway. The enemies pose a reasonable threat at the start, which increases as the game progresses. Resources are evenly distributed in the world, but they still take some effort to find. Hard. Enemies are serious threat from the start, dealing more damage. Resource management is key. This mechanics offer fewer shit. So, I don't know about you guys, but I played Dying Light 1, but I never beat it. And the reason I never beat it was because the gameplay was really incredible, but the story was absolutely terrible. Um, and... Uh, everything that I've read about Dying Light 2 is that the gameplay is much better and the story is much worse. 
Yeah. Um, so that's cool. <laughs> well, that's, that's normal. I'm normal. Hey. Yeah, but that means I can say you said something, and you can't stop me. Yeah. Jesus! Hey, kitty! Kitty's scary. Yeah, so Dying Light 1 was a, a, a failure. The, the guy lost. No, that's my water. I should probably pay attention. Oh no, it's a zombo. Oh no, I lost my nice knife. No, I'm on my water. Oh, that's why Skill Up did this. Par here. You know, this game used to be more fun. <laughs> you used to be younger. I <laughs> dumber. What matters is you still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim yeah, is a dead, a dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. Wait. Is that Troy Baker again as the different main character? No, it's not? Okay, it's just the same exact fucking voice. Okay. How am I doing? Oh, I'm stuttering. Oh, I'm stuttering. Don't care for that. Hold on one moment. This is what happens when games come out hot like this. Yeah, I'll keep this resolution. That's a little better. It's probably because I'm streaming it. We'll just we'll just deal with this. Though it actually still looks good at 1440. RB to jump. Why is my head so big? Look at that. I did a jump. Is it because I have a big brain? Thank you. Well, I don't even have to sprint to get the good speed. Just regular movement. Shit, man. You're still strong. Yes, thank you. I am strong. <laughs> I did it. Thanks. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Come. I want to show you something. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. Oh, you've been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. Uh, so are you. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Why does he yeah, run right. like that? Seriously, I wish I had as much energy as you. Got Why are you twitching? Nah, uh, trail Sir. cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. He's Some old? Five I don't know. Left in a ramshackle fence. I don't know if that's Nobody the reason. Nobody heard of her. Look at that. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. Uh, no way. Oh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here, too. A and? 
What do you fucking want from me? Survivor. Okay. Chamomile. Chamomile. Honey. Yeah, this'll do. Why do the bees not care? That old herbalist we helped escort to her village. Oh yeah, the one that had that saying. Uh, remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine. I took the bees. You. you just might go on living. Medicine, huh? I've received a blueprint. Let's craft. Wow, we're getting right into it. Blueprints will help you craft things. This is where you store craft parts. Head over to this and make a medicine. I did it. I made a medicine. Come on. We're almost there. Okay. Okay, that's my punch. What's duck? Oh, it's that? Ooh. Ooh. This is it. Come on. Huh. I will follow Spike. Thank you. Somebody had a nice crib. Yeah, this is pretty nice. Damn it, locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. Batman. Yet all. I uh, I thought you said there wasn't gonna be enough. Mm. Oh, thank you for chicken. Paige made me some chicken. Are there different control systems? Let's find out. I don't know why I'm looking in here. Game screen size? Wait, why am I not... ...running this in DirectX 12? Isn't DirectX 12 good? I'm gonna try it. What the fuck? What the fuck? Can you guys hear that? Okay, it, it decided to do... Now it's invisible! Oh, this... Man, PC games right at the start are just great. Like, they're just great. Okay. So I want to blame Dan the Pumpkin Man uh, for crashing my game just now. Because he said, quote, another streamer I was watching had some issues when they tried DirectX 12, just a heads up. Uh, and then they crashed my game. Thanks a lot, dude. Well, I guess you're right. Gonna immediately go fix that shit. What happened to the game? Don't worry about it. Just gonna very, very quickly... 
get out of there. Yeah. Okay. So when you change, um, when you change, uh, renderers in this game, it, it fucking restarts the game with no warning. Uh, which is super lit. Super lit. There we go. Hey, we did it. Let me get you guys back. Thank you. All right. All right. Control thing. Controls. Gamepad. I'm on. Yes. That's what I'm using. I'm using a gamepad. Vibration on. Auto aim on. Auto aim melee weapons. Invert your paraglider expert. Emma. Okay. Controller view. That's all. Ah, here we go. We got right handed. Lock. Equipment. Attack jump LB and RT is a kick use consumable crouch turn back there was no warning okay, whatever. we're just gonna continue and see where it gets us. bye darling there was no warning I don't know if you guys saw one but there wasn't one if you if you saw it um uh, that was a fake. That was a hallucination. Oh, look, I'm here. Wow. <laughs> Somebody had a nice crib. Damn it. Locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. Okay, Batman again. Aha! Yeah, I could really go with a flashlight. I did it. Empty. Some gold coins. The last spring party. I mean, cool, I guess. Five years later, who remembers Haran? Me? I was, I played it. kind of looks like the Baker house, doesn't it? <gasps> My character has no hair. My character probably looks like a default character. Okay. I'll just grab this uncommon valuable. Have I tried ray chasing? No. I'm running a stream while running audio processing. I'm gonna try- I always tend to try and undersell the graphics power here. so that the game can actually have a chance of running okay. You know, it feels like I'm gonna get attacked by a zombie. Yeah, just rats. I think it's time we parted ways. Why? I'm starting to worry about you. And you know our saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. What? 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 Why? Ooh, some rice. I don't like how I have to hold the button down. Nothing in here. Ooh, some rags. Resin. 
Good old resin. What are you what are you talking about? Hey look. A bottle. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. Like shit. Oh wow, you have whole body awareness. Who do you voodoo? Hmm. Sounds familiar. Okay. All right. And that's what they called art? Yeah, bro. Looks pretty or whatever. I could I could kill for a flashlight, dude. Like for real. What does that mean? Hide area. Okay. Not a zip. Zippo. Ooh. Ooh, some rags. Ooh, delicious. Some scraps. Uh huh. What's in here? Nothing. Wow, the scrounging really is just ping that fucking shit, isn't it? Cigarettes. Oh, and there was a resin. Cool! was upstairs you check out the garden okay okay wait i thought he was splitting up with me don't get it wow a lot of skeletons out here Well, these two idiots. At least they had each other. His jeans made it out. She was classy. Very classy, yes. Wait, is that? What is that? Dude, where's the city this game's supposed to take place in? I guess over there. Man, that looks like Dave Oshry. Dearest Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Hey, come here. Check this out. I don't know. After about uh, this has been 15 years since the zombie apocalypse. You would think that people would just get used to the absolute misery that is like normal existence. 
Like, you wouldn't be shocked by this kind of shit anymore. You'd just be like, yeah, well, uh, We're all dead. Hey, bro, what up? Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it. By Fucking the sick. Body. May it be of more use to you. Here. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Uh, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. Wh who? Doesn't matter. I tracked down that guy for you. This guy, a guy from the first game? Which of these is the one that goes forward? And which of these is the one that asks for more details? Yellow advances? Okay. Prob probably. Hey, what, what, what guy? Quit pretending. You became a pilgrim to track that fucker down. Waltz. I found someone who knows him. Why? Why did you say so what? earlier? And you're only telling me now? <laughs> when I tossed you a beer, thought you guessed right away we were celebrating. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly, he knows something about Waltz. Villador, I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary. It's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. And where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. But when something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected, then suddenly they're knocking on our doors. All right. But you owe me one. Is that a rock? Uh, not just one. So, what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. It'll You'll also give me a you cool view. On a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Totally me to hear from you soon. I will go straight to the city. I'll just go straight to the city. It's not that simple. Villador was supposed to be one of the zones. Cities that were walled off to keep out the plague. The plan fucked up. But this city and its walls survived. But this guy knows a way in. Get in touch with him and he'll tell you everything. What do he want from me? What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes racing me, and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe, well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. Eyes? I was gonna say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're gonna live there. No one's gonna drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that.
No, that's not good. Don't do that. Someone will have to clean that up. And that Waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah. Yeah, one day. Well, <sighs> my time's up. So when will I see you again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that Waltz guy. Or whoever you're looking for. And remember... 140.200 megahertz at dawn. The guy's waiting for you. Yeah, I remember. I have a bat. Hell yeah. Kill. I want to jump, man. Okay. Th thank you for the stick. Off we go. Get to the radio. I just sheathed that fucking baseball bat like it was a sword. The extended HUD... Wow, I look like the most, pro like, generic protagonist that ever was. Did you guys see me? Journal. Get to the radio. Ooh, what about hints? Oh, look at all these dank hints. What am I supposed to mouse over? That this will go away? Thank you. Sure. Thank you. Can't look at the map, but what I can look is at the skills. We have movement. Sorry, we have kill. And we have run. What's the biggest kill? What's the biggest run? Oh, that's pretty big. Man, the frame rate got way better as soon as that dude left. Good to test. I did it. It's about to be nighttime, right? Isn't that bad for zombos? Yes. Yes, it is. The wood lake boat. Whoa! Ah, biters. Well, that felt good. <laughs> Empty. Yeah, this is satisfying. I like the part where you hit them. Hello? Anybody here? Delicious. Give me them cans. Ooh, chamomile. Bees. 
Oh, thank you. I got the bees. My favorite. Wow, there's just shit everywhere on the fucking floor. Everywhere. What do we got here? We got another hammer. Oh my god, you see how big that dude's ass was? That was like a Germa dump truck. Look at a ledge and jump towards it to grab it. What fucking ledge are they talking about? Oh! Interesting. Interesting. Where's, where, where's the fucking... Where's the fucking thing, oh. Uh, uh, there you go. No gun in that cop car, darn. I need a fucking flashlight, bro. Oh, you're not attacking. How about you, though? Oh! Let's just, yeah, let's do this. Damn. That is a couple. I did it. Welcome to some bullshit. Got it. Forest retention. This is where the deers live. When they're not being chased by their mortal enemies, the automobile. Got it. Nailed it. Wow, that's pretty. Well, that's for later. Or is it for now? Looks like it might be for now. So I guess this takes place in the hipster-ass Pacific Northwest. So all the zombies will be complaining about their avocado toast. I don't particularly like avocado, so I don't really understand the avocado toast. Sup! So Oh, it's nighttime. Ah! 
Oh no. I thought that was gonna kill me. Oh, that's what that button on the D-pad means. The one that's underneath me right now, by the way. Okay. Oh, yeah, I did, yeah. <laughs> yeah, nailed it. Why'd that sound like the Terminator fucking theme? Jump higher. Got it. What a active landing. Reduce fall damage and keep your momentum. Okay. Or firm grip. Make the last climb on ledges even when your stamina's gone. Almost there. Oh, I'm seeing in the over over there the little parkour symbol. You get a little parkour points. Oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide somewhere for the night. It won't get any better than this. Hey, safe a place to sleep. about in there what the? time to go dude Holy shit! Son of enemies will use a power attack! When they're gonna use one, his health bar blank red. Dodge. To do a dodge, do the RB to different sides. Oh boy. That is an anime. Get rid of you, fuckers. And where's the big boy? What the? Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you. Just done? You done? That was close. Fucking assholes. Oh, medicine. How nice. And a rich wrist watch. And an invective trophy. You know, that would have been helpful. Yeah, sorry, the wrist watch. Me saying wrist watch, that must have been, um... That must have been the RTX screwing up my voice. Because I definitely said wrist watch. The broadcast station should be here somewhere. SW Fanatic, I don't need mo heavy whammo. Okay.
Oh, okay. Okay, I don't need more heavy ammo. What the? F Wait, why does my fucking z zombo sense detect fucking old footprints? Take, it's gonna take me a second to get used to these controls. They're a little different than what I was expecting. Hey, I got a raggedy chopper. Huh? It's been moved. I see. Okay, let's give it a try. Hello. This is it. The broadcast station. I gotta start the generator. I thought the broadcast station was the antenna. Oh, I can change the tapping QTE stuff? Oh, thank goodness. Controls. Is that in game? Streamer mode, subtitles, 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 subtitles. QTE, hold on. Yeah. All right. So where's the generator? Downstairs, huh? No, out outside. No, oh, it's in where I was trying to get in. G good. I just went in a circle. Another raggedy chopper. Oh, this is much better. Just hold that button down. Really? Okay. Well, it looks a lot nicer now that, you know, it's not terrifying. Hey, look at that! A nice little UV lamp. Safe zone! They have a UV light. Player stash. Extras. Miscellaneous. Outfit. Paragliders? But I don't have a power paraglider yet. It feels like it would be cheating if I got that. Bite on these nuts? No, I don't want to. What is this reload shit? Yeah, I'm not gonna touch this. For now. Hey, let's roll. It's obviously this.
This is Aiden. Over. Anyone there looking for a pilgrim? Over. Uh, it's got to be at dawn, though. Way. Go craft a gun. Uh, enough of that. Can I do that? I'll try again in the morning. Can people just build a gun? Is that a thing? Like now? No, when we're old. <laughs> now, Aidy. We need supplies. Everything's ready. It's so quiet. Where is everyone? Maybe they're all dead. <laughs> You're stupid. Let's go. Now. What? Why do the walls look like that? Wait here. Yo, Nothing these kids are bald. Have you brought twelve, three, four, six? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry. They'll let us go soon. Baby, I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. I know. What's up with all these Caillous? find each other Lord Almighty Maybe this, maybe this. Oh no, I was also bald. How embarrassing. How embarrassing. Fire! Fire in the lab! Just gotta go find Shepard. Tell him about the Reapers. God, that was awful. The story is quite bad. I'm excited. Time to contact the guy Spike was talking about. Also, 80? Terrible. Terrible nickname. This is Aiden. I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? It, yes. I was supposed to get in touch with you. I thought you'd change your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. 
I just want to find Mia. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I... Can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnels through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. That's not a very clear direction. But okay. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris, and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I'm going to the rendezvous. I'll see you later, Rita. I did it. Huh. Yeah. Oh there, well, oh, there was the tower the whole time. I didn't have to climb it. Isn't that a twist? Huh. Burning every iota of skin off my hand. Every single fucking iota. Every cell. Bees. My friends. The bees. Oh, cool. God is dead. Excellent. Is it still hip to fuck bees? Yeah. What is an amortizer? Zephyrdia quest, sir, the amortizer. This sounds like the fucking music you'd hear at the end of a fucking Sonic game. Like Sonic 2. It doesn't? Yeah, it does. You're a lizer. You're a lizer. Big lizer. <laughs> That's some zombos. Looks like a zombo. Can I get a map yet? No. Oh, it was the trees that were hurting my frame rate. Loud and clear. That means you must be close. I swam across the lake. So, you've almost reached the tunnels. There's an entrance. The only one the GRE left when they sealed off the city. I'm coming from the other side. Hurry up. What's wrong? What's up, dude? Hurry. Bitches. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh! You know, it's funny. I watched Skillup's review of this, and he described the, the melee as, like, he was worried that it was just going to be Skyrim. And the singular, like, big difference, even though I'm just swinging like this, is the hit reactions and physical effects on the characters makes all the difference in the world. Right? Like... Just- just having them go, oh, instead of just stand there and take it. 
I thought I was going to be able to go in that building. Guess not. Oh, this is... Okay, we're gonna definitely need to... There we go. Yeah. That's not... That's not feasible long-term. Yeah. Yeah, they're everywhere. Dying Light 1, its absolute best thing was the creation of what I would call the zombie economy. One zombie, no problem. Three zombies, kind of awkward. Five zombies, I'm out of here. And populating areas accordingly. Over there. Shit. Oh! Didn't think that was gonna happen. You guys know what I mean by the zombie economy, right? seem like a really dangerous location due to the lack of viable escape. The game's art direction is strong. I'll tell you what. Is anybody there? Doesn't look good. Sure don't. Uh-oh. Oh my god. <laughs> nah, man. powers just now. Are you all right? You fucker bit me. A volatile. Lots of those fuckers in the sewers. You must get into the light quickly. Later. We have to <laughs> resist it. It'll pass. <laughs> Just stay Wait. Strong. What's the rules we working on right now? We've been looking for you. <laughs> what about this one? Uh, seems dead to me. Didn't have it on him. Let's go. We had Zombrex in uh, Dying Light 1. I don't have the key. I swear. My flashlight. No, no take you th yeah. Yay! Why does that guy sound like Dinobot? <laughs> yeah, 
Interesting. Huh. Yep. Cool. What was down there? Nothing. Huh. Yep. Uh-oh. Yeah, Dying Light 1, you got infected right away. You actually get infected in the opening cutscene in, our, uh, in uh, Dying Light 1. It's pretty funny. No, don't get the boss. Oh, my flashlight turned off for cutscene reasons. Thank you. seems juiced. Perfect block. Got it. Yeah? What do you got? Yeah? Yeah, what do you got? Bitch. Got him. Vault kick. Jump over a staggered enemy and follow up with a kick. Run towards a staggered enemy to do a jump. Then press the RT during the vault to kick an enemy. Wow, drop kick is number one, huh? Come on, kid. Good. Combat feels really good. Story's terrible, though. Who was that? There's no time in my pocket. I left you something. What is this? A GRE access key. The PSD Are you serious? It was just in your pocket? They found it. We cannot lose it. You were going to tell me what happened to my sister. Where's Mia? You will go to Fish Eye. There, ask for a girl named the Wan. Give that to her. With it and her help, you'll learn. You will learn everything. Understand? No! Protect it. If Waltz gets his hands on it, the whole city, everyone will die. What? Waltz. Is Waltz here? Ooh, yes. I'm having the strongest deja vu ever right now. They're coming. You hear that? Renegades, run. We'll go together. Take this. Right, let's go. Fuck. Yeah, I'll cut somebody. There's our lost lamb. And he's not alone. We can fix that. We can slaughter him. Parkour combat. Use vault to increase your mobility. Run a staggered enemy and hit RB. Hit RT while doing the kick. This is the foundation of parkour combat. You should be 
Holy shit. Bitch. Oh, this is the baby tutorial for baby. Oh, I see. Hold on, hold on. Oh, I have. It has to be forward. Got it. Huh. Oh, I see. You get to actually choose. Also, where'd my fucking knife go? Damn. Got him. Ruh row. Remember my power attacks. Man, this is all Skyrim needs. Doesn't even need the f Skyrim Elder Scrolls. Elder Scrolls. Yeah, this feels really good. Wait, what? Okay, got it. Feel like I might have too many knives. He gave me a knife, but I didn't I didn't need the knife. Let's see what skills I actually learned soon. Air kick. Dropping on enemies from above, nail them with a powerful kick. Perfect dodge. Dodge at just the right time to stagger an enemy. Press RB while moving back or to either side. A successful perfect dodge staggers them. Interesting. Come on, Aiden. Let's get the fuck out. To here, are you there? Do you have my key? It's Walt. We have to run. But I'm looking for him. You we idiot. He'll kill you if he finds you. Kill on! Fuck! Get to the vent! Okay. This way. You first. Into the vent with me. What are you doing? Waltz can't get the GRE key, remember? What? Let me out! Fish high. The one. Go! Damn the traitor! Oh no! They're gonna kill him! Why did you betray me? This key is not yours. You can't... Where is it? Why would you answer that like that? I'm sorry. <sighs> Getting misty? Not really. 
You're only dying. Before zero hour, my grandfather raised horses. Beautiful rare breeds. I love them dearly. One day, his most beloved horse fell off the slope and broke his leg. I thought Grandpa would help him, but he just pulled out his pistol and put it in my hand. He told me, you're doing it for him. Then he pressed my finger on the trigger. I screamed. I wanted my grandfather to die. But years later, I realized what must be done must be done. You leave me no choice, my friend. Why, why? So much here. You idiot, just move. Oh, my character's really stupid. Run. Run from the scary man. He's so evil. He's got a German name and he's a mad scientist. Big evil. Oh my god, is it because I hit the barrel? That's so silly. That's so silly. Did it. Ooh, this is cool. Oh, that hurts. Cool. This is an Assassin's Creed 2 tomb, isn't it? What's happening? You gotta get into the light before you turn full Zombo right away, dude. Duh. Wait, get into that UV light, bro. Who the fuck is this? Yo, I feel like shit, dude. Thanks, Bizarre Man! Oh, cool! Leave him the fuck alone! 
Thanks, dude. Who the fuck are you? They'll tell you about. Shh, shh, not now. <laughs> Yana, get the inhibitor. Who the fuck is it? Dr. Terry, will you? Bring him here. Ah, fuck. Yeah, they gave me that good shit. Oh, yeah, this is good. That's good, like. He's moving. Hack on? Kill him, hack on. Kill him before I do it for you. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax. Breathe. <laughs> Seems he hasn't turned. Yeah. Seems? Hack on, I don't want that here. You've come back to us. Blink if you understand. Blinky, blinky. Oh, my head. Oh. You were on the verge of turning, but UV light and inhibitors pulled you back. Uh, the bat helped too, of course. Good old bat. You're alive. Let's keep it that way. This guy almost kills us all, and you're chatting him up. Yes, sir. Girls, relax. They're frightened. You almost destroyed their workshop. We need to move out. Can you walk? But I, I don't understand. Where are we going? To a safe place. I gotta get to the fish eye. The fish eye? Without the biomarker, you won't get near it. What the hell is that? Biomarker. Monitors the disease's progression in the dark. That's your ticket into the city. Without it... Huh. Stepping out of the light is sort of a lottery. You don't know when you turn. You need a biomarker. And I know where to find one. Interesting. Come on. We need to go get a video game mechanic. <laughs> He's turning again. Relax. Everything's under control. It'll be fine. Hey, you're weak. Take a minute. Drink. Seriously? What next? Maybe we should draw him a bath. Sounds pretty cozy to me, ladies. Uh, maybe next time. Get Why are you guys so mean to me? She adores me. Why are you helping me? Let's get to know each other and find out. You go first. Where'd you get all those? None of your business. You're careful. Good. You live longer. You a real pilgrim? Or did you steal that badge? I'm a... I'm a I was a pilgrim. An hour to dusk. I'm serious, Hakon. He's not staying the night here. Here. Your weapon and your radio. Thank you. Not even a pilgrim could get by without that. That's not my weapon. I had a bat, but hey, whatever. You think I can rob them? Yes. Infected playing card. Hello. That's a nice place. Don't get comfortable. We don't need another roommate, especially one that could rob us while sleeping. Not every pilgrim is a criminal, you know. Uh-huh. You have a nice workshop here. Assembling UV lamps, huh? Yeah. You shouldn't be here. Hakan's risking our asses. Yeah, well. Hakon's completely out of his fucking mind. Yeah, well. I'm sorry. I guess I scared you, huh? Felt better after I hit you. Or even. Yana. Aiden. What is this place? Our home. Our workshop. Our whole world, you might say. You're nicer than she is. Hey. That's true. Back off. 
Sarah doesn't trust anyone but me. Besides, I'm a better fighter than she is, so I can afford to be more open. Okay, let's go hang out with our new friend. <laughs> Not bad. Where's the fish eye? The canteen is there, in the center, past the chemical dumps. Uh, I need to get there. Too bad. Only way to go is through the tunnel. They protect it like a portal to the fucking Valhalla. Near impossible to get through. How do I get to the tunnel? It's my specialty. Where's the tunnel? <laughs> Not so fast, cowboy. You won't get far without a biomarker. You are a threat to everyone. And you've already seen how people in Villador react to a threat. Me? Well, can you help me? You seem to be familiar with the city. I've lived in this city since before the world got fucked up. I could help you, but... You need a biomarker. You won't get far without it. Where are you from? Pretty far, I guess. About 2,000 kilometers. Oh, shit. How the heck did you not get infected? That's easy. Didn't let him bite me. Here it's different. Here we're all infected. Heard of Haran. They isolated Villador too. They built walls. They locked us in. Turned out to be the thing that saved us. And how do you get a biomarker? Ah, uh, you can't get them. Unless you know the right people. And I do. Let's go. By the way, I'm Hakon. I'm Aiden. Nice to meet you, Aiden. Welcome to paradise. Well, the interesting thing to me is that, um, like everybody looks like a like a medieval like Dark Ages person. And this thing's gonna break. Over here. Cool layout. Oh, you do know the moves. I was in the military. A special unit? For seven years. I even liked it, except when I didn't. For insubordination, got blacklisted and they zeroed my bank account. Ended up driving a cab. Ouch! How the mighty have fallen. <laughs> Fuck you! At least I got to know my way around the city. That's oh, true. Come on! You're too oh, I weak. fell. Without an inhibitor, you won't last. Didn't I smash everything in sight last time you gave it to me? That was just the first time. But then it gets better. If you survive, of course. Catch! Okay, thanks, dude. Died? If I hadn't given it to you, you would have died anyway. So, why are you helping me? I know people are generally scared of you guys. But one pilgrim saved my life. I was a pilgrim. Now I'm infected. It'll be much harder to travel. <laughs> then welcome to your new beginning, my friend. Check out this place. They're like treasure chests. Usually got good stuff in them. Check it out. I'll wait. It does look very pretty. Oh, it's a roof grove! They got lots of honey and chamomile. And there's also some weapons, probably. Good old resin. People hide a lot of things in places like this. In case someone can't make it back to a shelter before dark. And that's why it's okay to steal from them? Steal their bees? Oh, like, I just stole their bees. Why 
What's that? Crystals. Someone must have stashed them here. They formed after the chemicals were dumped on us. Some believe they delay infection. Folk superstition. So you don't collect them? Sure I do. Superstitious people pay a fortune for them. It is and not a J.O. crystal. Take someone's cash. There's one specific chest I'm after. Come on, let me show you. Wow, you fucking book it. Come Look on, at him go. On. Stop. You just told me to come on. So, you have an army here? Ugh, the peacekeepers. They treat people like that too. Watch out for them. They guard the tunnel you want to go through. Got it. Tell me more about them. Tell me more about them. They consider themselves righteous protectors. Uh, they are good at killing infected. So you got to give them credit for that. They're pretty efficient killers. Yeah, but their righteousness comes with a price. Always remember this. You either play by their rules or you're fucked. Their protection of the bazaar is more like an occupation. I've handled these types of guys before. On the trail, I met a lot of tough guys who talked about the new order. It always seemed like the same old shit to me. Yeah. He's like that here too, and the PKs are getting worse. Pe Peacekeepers, got it. I will watch out for them. I'll proceed with caution. Good. Though it might not help. The PK are a pain. Seriously riling up the bazaar folks. The bazaar is a box of dynamite one spark away from blowing up. Hey, are we going? You uh, wanted to show me something? Sure, follow me. What about those zombos, dude? You don't care about that? Crawling in that ass. Faster. Almost there. I hope there are no surprises. Flashlight. It's dark. They are about to wake up. Quickly, open the chest. Is there good shit in here? In return, we'll get your biomarker. Fuck. Thieves. Wait. No, 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 leave it. Mess up that lock and everything's fucked anyway. Enough for a biomarker? Where'd you get that? I've been all over this city more than most, but even I haven't seen working GRE equipment for years. I love him, but... What if I'm protecting him by not telling him? I 
How important is this? Who knows? Maybe I'm not gonna tell. I'm looking for someone, someone important, and uh, this should help me find her. But where did you get it? It's better for you not to know. Believe me. If you say so. Oh, there they go. Fuck me. We took too long. Plan B. Run like hell. Big boys are out. Oh, they've got they've got the little markers on. UV lights are fun and helpful. They're close. Go on. The Ruth's goodies. I'll be back for you, buddy. Yeah, I can hear it. We're almost there. A bit further. Open up. Hello. Stand in the light. I'm in the light right now, dude. Uh, hack on. Uh... Come on. Open up now. I got a howler's coming. Oh, fuck. Biomarkers. There's no time. We've got the howler on our asses. Biomarkers. Did you hear? Behind us. I said biomarkers. Here. And his? He's with me. I have to see his biomarker. Let us just inside the door at least. I need to see his biomarker. How about some electronics, huh? Fucker. I should probably get a biomarker. Piece of Oh. There's no time. Oh, that thing sucks. Oh boy. What if I want to look back? It's cool. There's more and more of the maiden. No, you're clipping. You're clipping. No, you're clipping. We'll be safe there. Here, huh? Killian, keep them busy. Really? Killian, fuck, Killian, come on. Killian, took over my body this morning and get killed. Ah, it's hard. Stop them. Okay. Bitch. You pay for this one day. Get up in the fuck up. Get out of my fucking face. You pay for this one day. Anybody? I doubt we're done. Trouble loves company. Oh boy. Oh 
boy. Is that all of them? I think so. Help me. Really? That got all of them? Punched me? Oh, God damn it, Gillian. Should have waited a while longer. Almost did. Didn't want to clean your guts off my doorstep in the morning. They've left, so can you. Oh, come on, stop being such a bastard already. Look at this. Why are people so interested in like a G-Force 2? That's rare. Invite us in or it'll get even more rare. And who is this? Let us in. If you let us in, you'll find out. Shallow breathing, dilated pupils, sweating like a pig. You're about to turn and you came here? Don't even need to look at your biomarker. Hey, you see so much, then why not do something about it, huh? Besides, I don't even have a biomarker. Used to help people, Killian. I'm a pilgrim. Haven't been here long, have you? How did you get into town? I'll tell you everything. Just let us in. I waited for a pilgrim once. He was supposed to. Ah, oh, forget it. Doesn't matter anymore. What are you up to, hack on, huh? I gave him an inhibitor. He survived. Are you mad? He needs a biomarker. Don't have one. Bullshit. Seriously. <sighs> Motherfucker. Just give me one. The hospital, then. I was hoping to avoid it. Always looking for an easy way, huh, Hakon? I just need a UV lamp. I'll come back for you. Hold tight. Hakon, why are you helping him, huh? Remember when we used to help people? Me? Sure. But I doubt you do. Stay here and rest by the lamp. Don't listen to that dumbass. I don't know. It's gonna be pretty boring just sitting around. Mmm, delicious. Everyone around you said that's what you should do. Cook. Life would have been easier. No night runners, no hack ons, no problems. I'm gonna talk to him. But no. You wanted something else. Higher fucking causes. And you could just cook. What is a biomarker? Biomarkers. Why are they so hard to get? Because they're complicated devices. Hell, the factories that made them have been out of commission for years. Biomarkers are key to blood. They can't be reused after someone sinks with it. Without them, the infection runs unchecked. Like what's happened to you. That's why people pay a fortune to get a new one. All the money and crystals they have. Fortunately, me and Hakon found a place where they can still be made. What is an inhibitor? What's wrong with Hakon giving me inhibitors? Kills most people in seconds. It's a powerful drug. Most can't handle it. But I survived. I said most. So don't get excited. Just be careful with them. You, you guys, you guys kiss? You and Hakon, you known each other long? Too long. What did he mean when he said that you used to help people? We served together in a special... Ah, uh, doesn't matter. Ancient history. Where can I do a sleep? Where can I rest? So you just got into town. What brought you here? 
This ain't the promised land. Far from it. I need to get to the fish eye. And Hakon's helping you get there? You seem like a good kid, but take my advice. Don't go doling out trust like penny candy. Hell, how do you know you can trust me? You got a nice beard. Okay, enough, Jab. You look like Barry Burton. Go to sleep. Nothing to be done till morning anyway. Okay, sleep now. <laughs> Oh God! Aiden, Aiden, Jupido, Babudo. <laughs> oh man! Find me. Oh, that's cringe. Yeah, very funny. Did you make it? Almost. Biomarkers are at the GRE hospital. I'll be there shortly, but to get the job done, I need you to join me. Where should I go? With Killian's door to your back, you'll be pointing right at it. Hold the line. Marker of Plague. Meet Hekon at the hospital. I'll get a bill hook. Where'd he go? It's still nighttime. Night exploration. At night, the city streets are teeming with infected. Use rooftops. Avoid howlers at all costs. If they see you, they'll alert other infected. During a chase, be on the lookout for a hiding spot or hide within beams of UV lights. Keep to the roofs, because if the howler spots you. Yeah, I know. Don't want to go up against any of those anytime soon. Is that the hospital? 138 meters. Yeah. Once I was taking my second wife to the hospital. Never drove that fast in my life. Her waters broke three months early. You have kids? There was no saving that one. And other than that, none that I know of. Sorry. It's fine. What normal person would want his kids to see a world like this? Ah, oh, seems kind of lit. Run, 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 run. Whee! Yeah, nighttime seems fucky. Though it's less dangerous than uh, Dying Light 1's nighttime, which was just hyper dangerous at all times in every direction. Is that a hiding spot? Yeah, that's a hiding spot. Wait, are those level markers? The lock is broken. Don't worry. Find the old bus. The bus? At zero hour, a bus crashed into the hospital. Broke through the wall. You can use it to get inside. Since no one could get in, there's a good chance there'll be some markers left. Wow, this is dark as shit. Ooh, this, ooh, I like this. Every time the game starts getting, like, video gamey and I get to play video game, I'm, like, very, well, it's, it's crazy, because it's, like, every time you're playing it, it's like, wow, this is awesome. Every time people, characters are talking, it's like, wow, this is cringe. I'm at the main entrance. I marked a safe route for you. I'm waiting by the lobby. Ah! Oh, jeez. Oh, 
Oh wow, level two is a big upgrade. That's what you get. Oh, I broke it. I wonder. Will I cut it? Yes, I will. Got him. That was awkward. This way. Big building, huh? Do you already took over quite a few of these for drug research? When it all got fucked, they grabbed research volunteers. And they paid them loads of money. And what was the result? A lot of shit. It's a duffel bag inside the bus. Sure enough. Thank you. My gameplay is not cringe. Also, what the fuck is this shit? That's a serious case of black fucking mold. You gotta be careful with that. Bad for you. Cool, got it. Harsh goodbye, huh? Oh! I see. Just a little more. We don't have much time. Stay close to me. Oh. They said that new ones can be made here, and I don't know if I believe that. It seems pretty fucked. Door's locked. You know how to open locks? Sure. Turn the key. What if you don't have a key? Hakon, I've traveled thousands of kilometers. You think doors are a problem for me? <laughs> okay, just checking. I think this room should have all the instruments you need, Maestro. I, I see. Scrap. You can make lockpicks out of that. I like how he said that he found the scrap before I even fucking made the fucking thing. Cause <sighs> Good work. I already had scrap. I want lock picking. Oh yeah, it's Skyrim. Let's Skyrim this shit. Wow, it's literally just Skyrim. Fuck. Um, you didn't lie. You know your stuff. I had no other choice. Was forced to know my stuff. Oh man, I'm getting I'm oh, what the getting hell? the juice again. Not the juice. Damn. Oh, we're fucking. What the? What the fuck just hit me? Uh, 
elevator? Really? Oh, some help. There you go. That won't work. Shh. Let's go. This way. Dark zone in front of us. Keep quiet. Dark zone? What's that? Oh no, the children. Eddie, come on. Eddie, the beta. Oh Eddie. no. Mia? Eddie, where are you? That's a bad idea, Mia. If it was a good one, it wouldn't be fun. Mia, you're cringe. What are you doing? Not on the wall. Stop talking and give me your hand. Oh my god. Yeah, it's not there. It's a different hospital, you idiot. Aiden. Everything okay? Yeah. Are you sure? God. Talk to me. I've been somewhere like this hospital. This hospital. I've been in one like this before. A GRE facility. Well, there are a few of them around the city. I'm having these... these memories. The person I'm looking for is Mia. She's my sister. There was a the guy here named Waltz. I don't know. It's all mixed up in my head. Uh, you suppressed the memory. Like I did of my third wife. Look, I'm sure the infection ain't helping. Chin up. No. We'll find the marker and clear out. Let's go. Yeah, thanks. Oh, my head is spinning. Weird. And this guy is big on the arm movements. He loves it. Shh. Oh, cool. Sleeping beauties. Yeah, we have to walk past them. If you crouch and move slowly. What's the rules on the flashlight? You probably know that already. I do, yeah. Okay. Good. Bitch, you sleep like that. Damn, there are a lot of them. By a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Oh, give me a fucking break, dude. God damn. Oh, that was okay. What the? 
Why'd I pull out my fucking knife like that? I didn't even mean to do that. <coughs> what is that? Chemicals. Nasty shit. When they lost control of the virus, the GRE started spraying the whole city with that filth. Right. Worked out great for them, huh? <clears throat> mm-hmm. Oh, Jesus. So, this guy you told me about, what was his name? Waltz? Yeah. Yes. Why did you mention him? Because I remember he was doing some kind of experiment. <sighs> he wasn't the only one doing them. There were more cities like Villador, with walls cut off from the rest of the world. Many people were working toward a vaccine, Aiden. But, well, the world is full of shitheads. How are you so chill walking like 10 feet away from what? I thought that was a door opening. really far it's not stable come on just go just go just go just go just go Hurry. We're running out of time. <laughs> All right, how do I climb up? Oh, easy. I can't make it. Wait. I've got an idea. Remember the cocktail I served you earlier at the girls' workshop? Neighbors. Yeah? Exactly. You fell to the first floor. There's some GRE storage down there. Look for white green crates. Inhibitors should be inside. If you take another dose, you should get your strength back. Your GRE access key will open doors. Now go get some drugs. Oh, that's a big bitch. Don't move. You can't handle that. I know. I've seen this fucker. Yeah. Yeah, definitely can't fuck with that dude. Wait, are you guys alive? They are. Oh, 
Oh, that's where he went. I see. Locks from the inside. Oh, man. We're gonna have to do this the shit way. Oh, fuck. He's awake? Good stuff. Yeah, I'm out of here. See y'all. Aiden, hurry. If that infected finds you, you're dead. Hold on, I'm working on this. I'm trying to get golden points. Wait, what is that? Trying to get some soap. Aiden, Aiden, look, Aiden, quick! This way to the kitchen. We'll eat all the ice cream they hid from us. I'm scared, Mia. Yeah, me too. And I'm younger. Don't be a chicken, Aiden. What if the doctor sees us? He won't. Besides, he'd have to catch us, too. Come on! Don't back out now! I can't. Is Don't Pat yawning or cringing? Why not both? Why not both? Soap, resin, aspirin, camo breeches. Oh, yeah. Inherbiter is the only way to increase your maximum stamina and health. Increasing those attributes is important, so it unlocks access to some of your skills. Each upgrade requires three inhibitors. If you find them, go to the skills menu to level it up. Inhibitors can be found in GRE crates hidden all over. You need three inhibitors to upgrade your stamina. Choose stamina now, bitch. Immunity allows you to remain in darkness for longer. Oh, cool mechanic! I like that. What's up? I took the inhibitor. Oh, fantastic. Go back to the elevator. I'm waiting. That's a cool mechanic. I got a stick. Oh yeah, look at that extra stamina. Back on. Hurry. I found the markers. You said there was a place that these could be made. You were gone a while. How are you feeling? I'm infected, but good to go. Yeah, that's great. Sorry about this. What? Sorry about what? About that. On behalf of all its whores, bandits, and idiots, I christen you a citizen of Villador. Fuck. You're about to turn. Get into the <laughs>
That's fucking hilarious. me pilgrim huh? i never wanted to become a pilgrim i just sort of fell into it roamed the country for another reason entirely i'm looking for my sister and then what and then what will you do once you find your sister so somebody in the chat asks pat is this game dank jank or stank which is a great way to uh summarize uh, something. The gameplay's dank. The performance and bugs are a little jank. And the story is stank. So I'm gonna say yes. We're gonna settle down. I'll find have some a couple kids. Yeah, some place quiet. Gotta settle down somewhere now that I'm infected. Where will you go? Any place is better than this city. <laughs> well, that's a pretty low bar. I'll find a place where people aren't afraid of pilgrims. Aren't afraid of me. It'd be nice not to have to run and hide for a while. Why are people afraid of pilgrims? Fish. fish are good. Well, I have a very specific plan. You look like someone with a specific plan. I'd like to live by the ocean. You know, it's supposed to be easier there. I always wanted to learn how to surf. What, you find a bunch of old postcards or something? Ah, don't <laughs> laugh at my dreams, man. I know one thing. I have to get out of this city. It's killing me. Right from the inside. Will you help me? The ocean's a long way from Yeah, me. sure, dude, whatever. I'll suck your dick, whatever. Go to those. People don't want pilgrims for their neighbors. <laughs> Fuck people. I will help you with them. And you can help me survive on the road. You know the routes. You know how to survive out in the open. What do you think? We cover each other's asses. How does that sound? Deal. Okay. Let's do it. I'll, I'll cover so. your ass, Deal. bro. You won't regret this, Aiden. I promise. As for your goal, here's the situation around here. After the PK commander was murdered, they blocked the route to the center. They're trying to keep the killer from escaping. To get to Fisheye, we have to outsmart them. But I know when they change the night guard. That will be our chance. I'm gonna get the stuff we'll need for the passage. I have to suss out our odds. Meantime, that dog is baby sleeping around. right next to me, really? and he baby. Uh, come on. Let me show you something. You know exactly what I mean by baby sleeping, too. Here. You'll need these. Take a look around the city. Hey, Every cool! Day, plenty of interesting spots to check out. Binoculars. Binoculars. Hold left. Oh, my, bo my, my binoculars suck ass. You see the church? That's where the howlers were after us. It's the center of the district. No. Oh, there we go. Uh-huh. 
You can find notice boards with missing people around the city. One of them is near the church. Maybe somehow you'll find something about your sister there. And if not, just have fun. The world's already ended, right? How could things get any worse? I'll be back in touch when I've got a handle on things. I did it! I've unlocked the map. Let's go. Welcome to Villador. You've now unlocked the open world. First goal is to visit Survivor's Hub, and a merchant resting place and stash. Use your binoculars to find shit, like a windmill. As you explore, watch your compass for encounters. You hear that? Oh, these are locations. Yeah, I heard a dude somewhere. Aha. There we go. That's inventory up. These are broken. I don't understand. They keep saying... Th oh! got going on here what, what did I do to you got gotcha. you oh that's how it's gonna be huh I thought it would be funny. I would have died. You deserve a reward, man. I thought he was going to fucking attack me. What's up with that lady? She's so stinky. That was a stinky bitch. What's an immunity booster do? Generate regenerates substantial part of your immunity. Okay. Yeah, zombies are much easier to kill this time around, it seems. We go to 
Yeah, some of these people are literally stinky. Those people? Gerard was a great man. He shall now live forever in our memories. You'll remember him every time you need friendly advice, a warm word of encouragement, or even Are they even burying anything through the night. That's what Gerard was like. Always focused on others, never himself. We will never forget. There's a zombie right there. Part of this feels like fucking stalker. And I don't know how to explain why. Like the way things move. Just kind of feels like stalker. Hello. Some sweatpants. What the? Yeah. Interesting. Very interesting. Good, good one, Pat. Yeah. because there was a trampoline. Wow, that is a really incredible draw distance. First game had that too, come to think of it. Hey, I did it. That's what I did. I unplugged it and plugged it back in. Now everyone's happy. You make a, a, a windmill, when an active windmill enables abandoned structures to become faction structures. These buildings will contain merchants and all sorts of shit. The nature depends on who controls it. If you have not already, you must assign the zone's facility to peacekeepers or survivors. This will determine the, the quests and the type of people you let you find in it. Get down. Thanks, Aiden. It's nice to have a safe spot in the middle of this chaos. What? How do you know me? How do you know who I am? Hello? You're a merchant.
Can I sell things? I can sell things. Oh, I could get a hat. What's this? How much the merchant likes me? Sell all valuables? Don't mind if I do. You guys want me to buy the hat? Let's see what the hat's about. Damage resistance, survivor sense range. This is, hat looks like shit. That looks like shit. What is that? A trading post? Oh, okay. Best hat in the game? Is that true? I don't think that's true. But I also don't wear a hat right now. Do I just equip these when I buy them? Oh, I have my hat on. I look stupid. Green one. Bracers for a tank? Ranger? What the fuck? Medic? Ra What the fuck is that? Looks like we have a safe place to crash by the windmill now. Get down. Get down. Oh my god. What the fuck is this? As a location, I mean. Is it because of the tank? <laughs> Military convoy. But... Oh, I made a mistake. I'm going to I'm going to go deal with that later. And by later I mean probably never. The trucks have loot in them? Yeah, but But look. Do it no balls? No. No balls. I genuinely don't know how I'm supposed to get down sometimes. What is that? Was oh, that an uppy? An upper? Oh, that's nice. This ridiculous blockade at the center. That's nice. I like that. Take my. Oh, he heard you making the noise, Paige. Well, it's about that time for him. Yeah. Uh, could you do it, please? If that's alright. I guess we should go to the bazaar. Because it's my big glowing waypoint. I don't know if it's uh, the game's performance in general, or if it really doesn't like me streaming it. But, uh, I'm- I'm getting some stutters. Sixty-two meters? If 
fuck is 62 meters from here? Oh shit! Yeah, I'm a badass. Seriously, this is all I have on me, but you're welcome, bro. Well, active landing seems like something I would need. I want air kick or perfect dodge. Probably perfect dodge. I saved you, buddy. Oh, shit. Look at this motherfucker. Oh, thank you, darling. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's that time. Thank you, darling. It's that time. Do, 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 do. Do you want it? See, notice he doesn't go for it because I have not wiped his face yet. He just go lick. Because he knows. Look at this foam. Do you see the foam? Come here, bud. Come here. Oh. Oh, he's such a baby. He's such a baby. Okay, come on. Now, this is your evening one, so I, you don't... You just gotta get the, the foam off you. Okay. Okay. You don't need to do your wrinkles right now. But I am gonna do this wrinkle anyway. Ugh. Yeah, I don't know what's up. That wrinkle's always grosser. I know. I know. I know. Okay. No, no, no. You oh, come here. Sit. Sit. You're your baby. You're all, always your baby. You're... Oh. Oh. Damn. Okay. All right. Too fast. Too fast, buddy. Too fast. High five. Good boy. Sangate, speak. 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 Lie down. That sounds weird with RTX. I can't wait to look at it myself. Oh, I'm definitely gonna play it myself uh, off camera if the performance, I can get it somewhere solid. Skillup says he was able to get it somewhere solid, but I'm, I'm, I'm currently in a very bizarre situation the way I'm performing it because games that use a lot of GPU juice genuinely don't like it when I run yeah. The RTX and the stream. Oh, I could have taken him down. Damn. Sorry, dude. I've got a 3080 like you, and I'm managing 1440p. RTX on, DLSS balance at 60, 75 uh, FPS. It's definitely the, the stream, the, the way I'm recording it then. Some games don't mind being streamed on the same PC. Other games mind being streamed. What's wrong? I think a beast on me. Damn it. Okay, sit down. Don't want you passing out on me. It must have noticed how handsome you are and tried to pollinate you. <laughs> Very funny. It really hurts. Don't start crying now. Got anything for the pain? Damn, big baby. 
Maybe it was a zombie? <laughs> Good one. Could Go to hell, both of you. <laughs> Any last requests? <laughs> That's what I call <laughs> <laughs> What do you mean, what the fuck was that? I cut his fucking Must head off, dude. Madison. Hey, bitches, I got a biomarker now. Wait, the door just opens? There's even there's even a guard. My woman's gone mad. I'm supposed to sell you, my dear goat. What did you got against you, anyways? Maybe I do feed you a bit much. Okay, oh, it's a goat. But you deserve it. I, I love goat. I used to be scared of goat, but then I saw a goat that was cute. That's pretty much all it took. Got water for sale? I'll pay half a crystal per gallon. I ain't living the bazaar today. The wind is blowing. You're new, aren't you? You'll see. This place is full of secrets. Most of them you don't want to uncover. All right, that's nice, Oblivion Man. Oh, this place is chill as fuck. Are you up in the cloud district often? No, what am I thinking? Of course not. That was the most abrupt lighting change I've ever seen. Oh my god, this fucking... This fucking audio... Blowout. God damn it. What's the problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Man, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. I what 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 what? Hey, what's a craftmaster? You're not from around here, right? Craftmasters are people who invent new technology, design innovations, all sorts of gadgets that might help in combat. What? Alberto's the grand master around here. Like I said, I'm his apprentice. People laugh at him that he's slow and not very eloquent, but he's a real friggin' genius. What? What? What's this test about? I have to design something useful for the citizens. I already invented underwater reading glasses for Alberto, then a retractable dog leash. But he kept jamming. And besides, we have no dogs here. All my ideas are worthless. Now is my last chance to prove that I This is a fucking New Vegas NPC. I spent the last several weeks walking around the bazaar and thinking, thinking hard. And then, I hit it. Our goats, they're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. 
that would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I call this invention the electric fence. Yeah, Shin Ellison's right. He has a theoretical degree in physics. That's rough, dude. Yeah, that's a little rough. Stressed goats can give bitter milk. Seriously? Goats get stressed? And wouldn't you, if someone electrocuted you and then went for your crotch? Oh, no. It's only a very small voltage. Won't do more than tickle them. So what problem? So what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see. I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. As far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure. But it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Bandits roam in the area, so it's possible there's nothing left there. In which case you'll have to look for other patrol remains. Or take a night trip to the store. This is the weirdest tone ever. Like, like the game. Like, like it is, like it is genuinely like a weird cross between Outer Worlds and, and, and fucking Oblivion. <laughs> Looks like you're in luck after all. I have the parts you need on me. Are you serious? That's just fantastic. Heaven must have sent you. And here. I don't know how to thank you. One more thing. Could you help me set up my show? My installation's right outside the main entrance. Turn it on, please. I'll go get Alberto. Wait till he sees it. Meet me by the goat pen, then. Near the wall. I wonder what the hell is going on in the central Okay. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. I did it. Sometimes I can't sleep because of the Watch the Okay. I did. Let's do it. They think they have some kind of other disease. They won't let you near me. Okay. Everything all right? No. It's grilled. The goat is grilled. I'm such an idiot. What happened? I must have overcalculated the voltage. See, he's useless. I'm sorry. I you just killed a goat. So wrong. I told you it would be a waste of time. Why? I don't think so. This is very, very. It has big, huge. You're saying it has potential. Potential, yeah. It could be an effective weapon. A weapon? It's a ready formula. If you just use it on a weapon, it could raise your odds against turned creatures. The brave goat gave its life to science. There's dinner for everyone. And you? I no, you can't eat that. As, uh, and pronounce you, uh, uh, a, uh, craft master? Really? You can't oh eat that God. goat. Thank you. Thank you. We'll talk later. 
Come, Vincenzo. I can't thank you enough. Here, take this. If it's not strong enough, come around to my craft master workshop. Sure, thanks. Just uh, watch yourself out there, okay? No worries, friend. Why can't you eat that goat? You let you fucking electrocuted it. You need to slaughter the goat properly to drain the blood. If you don't, you will be poisoned. And also the poop in it. Weapon mod. Check the mod slot. Make the mod. I got... Found the enemies from above. Nail them with a power kick. Medicine. Throwing knife. Throwing knife? Odd. Oh, that's how it works. You just grab it. And mod it. I just got the achievement called, oh, so this is how it works, which is what I just said. <coughs> this game is, is absolutely the, the weirdest. At like, sometimes I wake up at night and forget to fall even like, it's f wow. Looking at all the dead people. That says here they're missing. Same difference. They never find them anyway. Now then why the board? It's been 15 years. Many people disappear back then. My neighbor lost his two kids. But life goes on, except nobody has the courage to take those photographs down. But it's hopeless. Since there are no night runners, the search always ends the same. What's a night runner? Those night runners, tell me about them. What's there to say? Nearly all of them are dead. When they were around, they were the only ones not afraid to go out at night. They rescued those who didn't manage to get to a shelter. But of the entire group, only a few survived, including Frank, their former commander. Once upon a time, he was great. Now, he drinks himself into a stupor at his place in the central loop. Hard to say how much longer he'll be around. What, 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 Mia, what? Have you heard of kids who were in the GRE tests? Huh, and who wasn't in the tests? The young, the old, the blind, the deaf. Everyone came to find a vaccine. Some for cash, others to cheat destiny and not get infected. But that was the devil's bargain of Villador. Walled in with the plague, but given the chance to be the ones who gave the cure to the world. Well, the virus won. The study was eventually discontinued. And the children? Officially, no one tested on children. Human rights and other crap. And unofficially? And unofficially. Apparently, some of the kids were taken out of the city. The rest, well, they just scattered around the city, abandoned. If the infected didn't get them, then hunger or darkness did. When, 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 when did, all did this that happen? happen? 
a long time ago. Looking at you, you are still a kid yourself. Once upon a time, I came across two of them, two girls. They were five or six years old, and it looked like they hadn't eaten for a month. What were their names? I don't remember. I threw them some old bread and took off because they were shaking as if they were about to turn. Red eyes, swollen veins. I don't know what they were giving them there. Those psychos from the GRE. How, how do you find, how do you find now? Where are these kids at now? After all those years, most of them are probably dead. If someone got luckier and is still wandering around, they would probably be in the central loop. More peacekeepers there. Easier to survive. Someone must know more. Why? The past is the past, and there's no point in dredging it back up. Everyone has their own problems. Here and now, Pilgrim. Everyone fights for themselves. Okay. But you didn't give me a quest or anything? Okay. Shop. Hey, bro. Oh, it's you. A craft master. They give you blueprints. Like a UV. Really? Damn. Oh, you just sell shit, huh, bro? What, what about you, dude? Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, Pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Julian, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But... I don't sell water. Liar! Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? Maybe he is a little suspicious. I wouldn't call it proof, but he was just trying to rope me into some shady deal. All I need to know. You're done, Julian. Oh, what, but what's your proof, oh, though? Wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water. Oh, a bottle. Uh, the, uh, right there. I tell Carl about this. You'll hang. Bevan, wait. I swear. I don't even sell water, damn it. If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast. Someone's been stealing our water. Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. I thought you weren't selling water. You sure? How do you store it? I buy bottles. There's no way it could become contaminated. Not a chance. My supplier, Marco, always has clean water. Wait, you but but it, it, but you don't. So, uh, maybe it's revenge. What? For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind. That's where me. you get your water. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador on Houndfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flower is yours. Can you do that? Ooh, thing? flower! I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and 
Can you go warn him? He's also on Hamfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. Fuck me, people will always complain. That is a absolutely bizarre quest. Everything about that was fucking weird. Okay. Let's look at the map. Cheers. Marco first. Oh, what's... What's that symbol? Oh, it's the military convoy. We have to pick this up. Oh. Why? Bro. Do you know how I found these? No, he didn't tell me. 48 meters. Oh, it'd be right there. Hey, look, it's a fucking school or whatever. Oh, you guys got, you got a quest? What's going on here? Hello, I'm Henkel. This student here was curious about my lesson today. About when the guns were confiscated in Villador. And what happened afterwards. He wants to light a candle on the site of the March Massacre. What? The March Massacre? Yes. 64 people died that day. Gunned down like sitting ducks. If you want to know more, you should go and see for yourself. Why? Why can't he? No one can leave the building while school is in session. Children shouldn't walk around the bazaar on their own. Hmm. I thought you'd be more worried about them falling into a dark zone. Oh, kids nowadays are too smart to fall into a silly hole. Anyway, could you light a candle for him, young man? You might learn something yourself. Okay. Sure, though I was pretty lousy at history. History is boring when someone tells you about it. It starts being fascinating when you can touch it. Touch it? Yes. Take this candle and go to the monument of the World Art Congress. Or what's left of it. It's close by. Contact me when you get there. You'll see what my lesson was about today. Okay. We're still gonna go this way, though. Fuck it. Dark hollows and forsaken stores are two open world locations that contain valuable loot. During the day, they're full of infected. So you can't, you gotta look at them at night. Forsaken stores get you good shit. Dark hollows get you good shit. Oh no!
Okay. Now let's get some bees. The fuck? Who just talked to me? Did you hear that? Oh, is the key. Center stage, fourth TV skin. Oh no! I don't know why I'm hitting you. Ban Bandit. I caught him. I caught him. No, not that. Oh. I stopped that crime. Where'd the GRE go? Tonight. What? <laughs> why, why am I not allowed to take him down? Do you, do you see that? <laughs> yeah, I'm not allowed to take him. Oh. This game is so weird. Also, wasn't there a GRE thing that was like, bro, you could you could GRE me up, bro? Wasn't it just over here? Where'd it go? Am I over here? The Jerry got marked on my map? Oh. That's what it was. My mistake. My mistake. My mistake. Okay, let's... Okay, that's good. I like that. What's up, idiots? Fuck. All 
All right, I think we made it to this guy's house. Oh, I mean, these are human beings. That's an Hi. improvement. Hi, is you there? I did it. Hans? Hans, your house looks like shit, dude. <coughs> oh, that moron must have taken the wrong bottle again. Forget his own head if it weren't stuck on his shoulders. Hey, what did you mean by the wrong bottle? He always takes a little rocket fuel with him when he goes hunting. But the booze is right here. That means he's got water. Where is he? And what business is that of yours? The water he got from Julian. It might be contaminated. He's hunting at this... Uh, the military tower, a, a few hundred meters west of here. Unless he's at the courts. I'll go to the tower. You check the courts, fast. Wait, wait. Take the booze with you, in case he's already drunk some of the water. I bet what's in this bottle will kill whatever's in that one. Good idea. Booze is basically medicine. I can't believe I made that jump. Fuck. Hey, what the- Ah, oh, goons! Holy shit, that's a lot of goons. Thank you, please be quiet. I did it! I killed the bandits! That's not really what I wanted to do, but... I mean, they were asking for it, right? They were sitting there peacefully in the dumpster. And I was like... Yeah! What the fuck is... Oh, he's right next to me? What? Red, ch red chest?
red one? Oh. Hello. Light sweatpants. Asporfin. Oh, he's up there. Hans. Hans? Oh, you old fool. Hans? Oh, there you are, bro. There we go. Hans! Are, are you Hans? What do you want? Did you drink any of that water? Goddamn right I did. Tasted like piss. It was poison! Oh, shit. That may have been poison, Hans. One sip. Then I spat the shit right out. Must have mixed up the bottles again. Whatever. Wait, whatever? Are you usually this calm about being poisoned? Who gives a shit? Not my wife, I bet. Don't think she loves me anymore. Okay. Here's some booze, Skyrim it's man. Booze. Take it. Your wife said chug. Drink it already. Bullshit. What? <laughs> my wife said that. My Anna. She thinks the alcohol's strong enough to burn the poison out of your system. Ha! Huh. My woman. <laughs> So she loves me after all, despite her bitching and What is this music? And they say romance is dead. Here, for making my day. And maybe saving my life. <sighs> Look, you need any help getting back? Nah, I'm good. Me and this bottle Nothing, he's barking at nothing. Some work to do. I don't know. Hey guys, I have a question for you guys. While this dude's been talking, have you heard Zangief losing his fucking mind? Got a taste for city life yet? Uh, I've been here and there. You know, the best part is always happening in the center. And that's where we're going. I have oh, a plan for how to get there. I'll tell you oh, where yeah. we spot. Meet me on the roof near the main metro station. Yeah, he's been losing his fucking shit. Alright, well this game's the most confusing fucking thing I've played in like two years. Th this dialogue is like the worst ever. Oh, yeah, it's bad. I'm digging it. Uh, I'm totally gonna put time into this off camera, but that's definitely it for us tonight. Oh, man. The chicken? Didn't you say that you made chicken? I'll take a steak that you offered me. When you get yourself a woman who gives you a steak, you, you put a ring on it. It's the only criteria. Yeah, get that stick in here, right in here. All right, <laughs> I'm quitting out of this fucking game. This game is weird. Uh, so that game's fucking weird. Like, for real. Also, I'm glad we were able to find a pseudo-technical solution to this, the quote-unquote Zangief problem. How was- so, for my own dialogue and talking tonight... Um... Uh, how'd the, the stream sound? Your barking was also cut off. <laughs> yeah. Feels weird without the background noise, honestly. 
Well, now we're in a different thing. So basically what I'm thinking I'm going to do is I'm going to run it normal. Like run it. Uh, that lab was cut off? I didn't actually have a lot of noise for that. I often like start and then do the ha 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 shit. So I'll have to look back at it myself, honestly. I'm very curious. I'm very curious. All right. Let's thank Peepo. And we'll send you over somebody else who's doing a cool stream. As long as you want to keep watching. Tomorrow, we're going to be doing... Me and Paige... Me and Peach Saliva are going to be doing the Path of Exile. Paige can't hear me. But she, Path of Exile... Paige. Path of Exile. Yeah. Uh, oh, that's right. But I can hear you. I love you. Um, I'm excited to check that out. For real. That's a sponsored stream. Please check that out. Uh, Alright, let's thank some people. Like. Half Awake. Thanks, Half Awake. And Ruben. Appreciate your subs. Is she reading? No, she's doing kitchen stuff. Are you starting from league start or regular time? I, I'm I'm starting at seven. What? What? Are you, regular time. Oh, you mean am I starting at the time of day that the new league is starting, or am I doing? My regular league is 7 p.m. GMT. What's a GMT? Is that what is seven? What is seven GMTs? Mount is that mountain time? I don't know what you fucking people are saying to me. I, I, I have no fucking idea. Mask of Michael, it's not, it's not get more of T's nuts. England, what about it? I'm starting at seven. That's when I'm starting. Ben Wilson sub, thank you. Happy two month anniversary, thank you, appreciate it. Short sweet sub. Kitten parkour kicked in a sub, sorry, so no. Kitten B sub to say parkour XP plus two, thank you. JJ Rossman sub, hey butt knuckin, happy subby, I hate that. Saren sub, getting kind of bloodshot here. I have 22 monsters in my fridge, enough to last me three days. Don't drink 22 monsters in three days, please. Big boy sub says, LOL, so conflicted. Not really sure what you're talking about, but I hope you resolve that. Attack on wake up sub, so didactic. And Val Hola Yoloson. Ashrock sub, would you recommend it? I don't know. I'm going to need to put a lot more time into this before I can give any significant thoughts on it whatsoever. The gameplay is so fun, but also jank, and the story is so bad. It's like, Borderlands 3 has a story that's so bad I couldn't play it. This has a story that's so bad I can just, I can only just be like, in astonishment. Every time it starts to happen. And Fefe subbed. Says Pat, Pat, Pat of Biden. What is it? Aiden, Aiden, Babaden? Is that it? Is that what she was saying? That, that's the worst. That's just the worst, bro. 
Oh, hey, my good friend Justinian Knight is playing Monster Hunter Rise, which we didn't play tonight because of the new release of, uh, of fucking, uh, what, uh, Dying Light 2. Thank you. Uh, me and Paige and Plague are planning to play a Dying, a, um, uh, Monster Hunter. It's the, it's the RTX voice. It's, it's, uh, it's causing some stopping and stuttering in my voice sometimes. Sorry about that. Uh, we're planning on playing Monster Hunter on Saturday afternoon. I'll see you guys there. And Attack on Wake gifted three subs. Thanks, Attack on Wake Up. Really appreciate it. All right. Time to go Rage Stinny Night. I'll see you guys tomorrow for Path of Exile. Y'all have a good... More like Path of Exile, am I right? Ah, fuck it.